What's up everyone, I want to show you guys how my live streaming setup, well also the live streaming dedicated live streaming PC and all the other stuff actually works and so on and I'm gonna try to speak as clear as possible for you guys to be able to understand me and also go into details with the stuff that's hooked up to the dedicated live streaming PC and right now I'm just holding the tripod in free hand and it's really really heavy so let's get to it. So first off we're gonna start off with my dedicated live streaming PC was not really meant to be a streaming PC, but it ended up being one back in 2012 and it has been upgraded ever since that, well actually last year it got upgraded with new motherboard and so on. I have uh, two AVIA media capture cards sitting inside of it, that's the one I'm pointing at right now, and there's two HDMI cables going to it. The first one, well the second one, with the green layout, well the green vinyl on it, is for the guest computer, which is pretty much the one Shuffleman is using. So here we have the DVI splitter, well it is actually an HDMI splitter and one of them is going, well one of the cables, that one with the white uh, DVI label on, or well DVI cable, is going down to the center monitor. The other cable, HDMI cable, is going all the way down beneath that uh, blanket or whatever you want to call it, and behind the monitors and all the way down the disk itself and up to the live streaming PC and it's pretty much capturing um, the second monitor over here. Cannot really tell which one it is because both of the monitors are using owls in the background to show off first PC gaming owl. Anyhow, the other one, the one that HDMI cable is sitting in the first capture card, it's pretty much the same principle uh, with just with a DVI HDMI cable going over to my live streaming PC and into the capture card. Also the same thing with audio, there's a splitter, audio splitter on both computers but they are not going over to the live streaming PC, they are going down to the mixer I have which is a Binaire Nox uh, 303. There is two, well that is three, it's a three channel mixer and um, I also label them with colors, you cannot see that sadly, but uh, the green one, there is a green and an orange one. The green one is for my sound, the orange one is for Shuffleman sound, and the center is for the microphone that Shuffleman is using. This microphone is actually to this camera, it's a shotgun mic, it's a old video mic pro, and it actually works uh, perfectly, and I was really surprised that I could use it for the live streaming setup and he uses it to talk in pretty much makes sense right talking into it right um, he was complaining about not having a mic while we were live streaming and I figured out a solution uh, let us see well then there's my microphone of course which is uh, AC Electronic X1 and it goes over to a phantom power I have down here uh, it's a little bit low light but you can perhaps see it and going into the mixer and on the mixer Way, way down there in the back, I know it's a cable cast, but it's my cable cast, I know how it works and how all the things is. Anyways, there's a cable way down there, um, an output from the mixer going up to the live stream PC and into the microphone port, which is uh, switched over to line in, so I can use it on open broadcast. The other thing is when we stream on triple monitors, well, play on driven monitors and play our games, it's really hard to see what's going on on the chat, right? Well, here's the thing, the main reason why I got this uh, USB monitor because I want to be able to see what's going on in the chat. It's an AOC, AOC uh, USB monitor. I do not recommend it, but yet again it's awesome to have. Um, well, recommend them, recommend it. If you want to get one, you may want to consider uh, putting in a PC that uh, do not have a dedicated graphic card because for some odd reason the link, well the link display port or whatever with that monitor and software is not working correctly when there's a dedicated graphic card in, inside of it, well inside the live stream PC. But that's how it is. Over here by Shufflemans, uh, well my guest rig which pretty much turns into Shufflemans computer even though I paid for the computer and so on. Um, I made a laptop mount because I want to have to well, give him the same uh, option to check out the chat instead of like asking me what are people saying or whatever stuff is going on. This I actually made recently. It's uh, on a tripod. I know it's not pretty but it works. And I hooked up a extra little um, 
extra little keyboard to it and he's using a wireless mouse. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to check out the rest of uh, well, the stuff that was inside the computers, the gear, specs, whatever, I will provide that down in the description and I will also provide um, the link to our new Twitch channel which is First PC Gaming. I'm not using my own anymore which is uh, GTA Wet Speed but I'm moving over to First PC Gaming since we want to be focusing more on First PC Gaming uh, to future events or for example like the website that was coming up firstpcgaming.com which is under heavy, well hot well, construction in general and will perhaps be up in a month or two, I hope. <laughs> so um, check out the link below with the first PC Gaming Twitch channel. If you like what you see, please follow. I will really, really, really appreciate that because that will help us grow and so on. But anyway, see you guys in the next one. And if you do follow, see you guys on the chat. And take care.